Welcome to our channel. Today, we're diving into the eerie and fascinating world of Chernobyl, a place where time seems to stand still, frozen on that fateful day in 1986. Join me as we uncover the secrets and mysteries that still linger in the shadow of the disaster. Buckle up, because these seven mysterious facts will blow your mind. Number 1. The Elephant's Foot Deep within Chernobyl's reactor number 4 lies a beast of terrifying power known as the Elephant's Foot. This grotesque mass, composed of melted concrete, uranium fuel, and other materials, formed in the aftermath of the explosion. It resembles, as its name suggests, the foot of an elephant, radiating intense heat and deadly doses of radiation. In the immediate aftermath, approaching this monstrosity, even for a few minutes, would prove fatal. Even today, decades later, the elephant's foot remains intensely radioactive. Scientists, clad in protective gear and using remote-controlled robots, have studied the elephant's foot, learning much about nuclear meltdowns. Their research provides valuable insights into the risks of nuclear energy and the importance of safety protocols. The elephant's foot serves as a stark reminder of the destructive power of nuclear energy. It is a testament to the bravery of those who risked their lives to contain the disaster. It's the world's most dangerous foot, definitely not something you'd want to step on in the middle of the night. Let us hope that humanity heeds the lessons learned at Chernobyl and strives for a future where such disasters are consigned to history. Number 2. Radioactive Red Forest Imagine a forest, not a vibrant green, but a chilling, almost surreal red. This is the Red Forest, a four-square-mile swathe of woodland near the Chernobyl power plant, forever marked by the disaster. In the aftermath of the explosion, radioactive particles rained down upon this forest, bathing it in lethal doses of radiation. The pines, once verdant and alive, absorbed this radiation, their very cells twisting and dying. The result was a dramatic and immediate change in the forest's appearance. The trees turned a rusty red color, as if autumn had arrived in an instant. This eerie transformation gave the red forest its name, a chilling reminder of the invisible forces at play. The trees absorbed so much radiation that they died and turned ginger. If Mother Nature had a hair salon, this would be the ultimate dye job. Today, the Red Forest remains one of the most contaminated areas in the Chernobyl exclusion zone. While some plant and animal life has returned, it is a shadow of its former self. Despite the dangers, the Red Forest holds a strange beauty. Scientists continue to study the Red Forest, fascinated by the resilience of life and the long-term impacts of radiation. The Red Forest stands as a testament to the enduring power of nature and the devastating consequences of nuclear accidents. Number 3. The Time Capsule City Imagine a city frozen in time, its streets deserted, its buildings decaying, its stories left untold. This is Pripyat, once a bustling city of 50,000 people, now a ghost town, preserved in the shadow of the Chernobyl disaster. Built in the 1970s to house workers from the nearby power plant, Pripyat was a model Soviet city. But on April 26, 1986, everything changed. The Chernobyl disaster forced the evacuation of Pripyat, its residents leaving behind their homes and possessions, never to return. Today, Pripyat stands as a haunting reminder of the human cost of Chernobyl. Its empty streets and abandoned buildings evoke a sense of loss and longing. Walking through it is like being in a post-apocalyptic movie, minus the zombies. Though, given the radiation, zombies wouldn't be that far-fetched. The propaganda posters still adorn the walls. The toys still lie scattered on the floors of abandoned apartments. Despite the decay and the desolation, there is a strange beauty to Pripyat. It is a testament to the resilience of nature and the enduring impact of human actions. Number 4. Mutant Wildlife In the aftermath of the Chernobyl disaster, one might expect a barren wasteland devoid of life. Yet nature, with its remarkable resilience, has defied expectations. The Chernobyl exclusion zone, once a symbol of human devastation, has become an unexpected haven for wildlife. Freed from the pressures of human activity, Animals have flourished in this radioactive wilderness. Wolves, lynx, deer, and wild boar roam freely, their populations rebounding in the absence of hunting and habitat destruction. Even more surprising is the presence of species rarely seen elsewhere in Ukraine. Brown bears, once hunted to near extinction, have made a comeback in the zone. This resurgence of wildlife is a testament to the adaptability of nature and the unexpected consequences of human actions. Scientists are closely monitoring the health of Chernobyl's wildlife, studying the long-term effects of radiation exposure. The presence of thriving wildlife in Chernobyl is a beacon of hope, a reminder that even in the face of disaster, 
life finds a way. While the Chernobyl exclusion zone remains a dangerous place, its wildlife serves as a powerful symbol of resilience. It's like a real-life zootopia, but with the added twist that some creatures might glow in the dark. Number 5. The Sarcophagus In the aftermath of the Chernobyl disaster, a monumental task lay ahead, containing the smoldering remains of Reactor Number 4 and preventing further release of deadly radiation. The solution was the construction of the sarcophagus. Imagine a structure of immense size and weight, hastily erected in the face of extreme danger. The sarcophagus, a concrete and steel behemoth, was built to entomb the destroyed reactor, a physical barrier against the invisible threat of radiation. Imagine the world's worst Tupperware container. It's a bit leaky, and what's inside is absolutely not for leftovers. Working tirelessly in shifts, under constant threat of radiation exposure, crews of brave workers assembled this modern-day marvel of engineering. The sarcophagus, while an imperfect solution, served its purpose, drastically reducing the release of radiation from the damaged reactor. However, the sarcophagus, exposed to the elements and the relentless assault of radiation, began to deteriorate over time. Recognizing the need for a more permanent solution, an international effort led to the construction of a new confinement structure, a colossal art-shaped edifice designed to contain the sarcophagus and the destroyed reactor within. The new safe confinement stands as a symbol of international cooperation and a commitment to learning from the mistakes of the past. It is a testament to human ingenuity and our determination to find solutions to even the most daunting challenges. Number 6. The Chernobyl Divers In the chaotic aftermath of the Chernobyl explosion, a new threat emerged, a threat hidden beneath the rubble of the shattered reactor. Melted nuclear fuel, a lethal cocktail of radioactive material, was burning through concrete and steel, threatening to reach the water tanks beneath the reactor. Should this molten mass come into contact with the water, a massive steam explosion, far more powerful than the initial blast, would occur, spreading radioactive fallout over a vast area. Hundreds of thousands of lives were at stake. A solution, as daring as it was desperate, was needed. Three men, Alexei Anonenko, Valery Bespalov, and Boris Baranov, volunteered for a mission of unimaginable danger, a mission that would come to be known as the Chernobyl Dive. Their task, to enter the flooded basement of the reactor and manually open the sluice gates, draining the water and preventing a catastrophic explosion. They were like a real life, less glamorous and definitely more hazardous version of the Ghostbusters, but instead of proton packs, they had, well, just their sheer will to live. Knowing the deadly risks involved, these men descended into the murky radioactive waters beneath the reactor. Time was of the essence and the radiation levels were lethal. Yet, with unwavering courage and a sense of duty, they completed their mission. The Chernobyl divers became symbols of selfless heroism, their actions a testament to the human capacity for courage in the face of unimaginable danger. Their story serves as a powerful reminder of the sacrifices made to contain the Chernobyl disaster. Number 7. The Ghost City Tours In the desolate landscape surrounding the Chernobyl nuclear power plant, a curious phenomenon has emerged in recent years a trend that speaks to our fascination with the macabre and our desire to confront the darker chapters of human history. This phenomenon is known as dark tourism, and Chernobyl has become one of its most popular destinations. Each year, thousands of tourists from around the globe flock to the Chernobyl exclusion zone, drawn by the allure of the forbidden and the desire to witness firsthand the aftermath of one of the world's worst nuclear disasters. It's like the world's weirdest vacation destination. I went to Chernobyl and all I got was this lousy t-shirt and maybe a slight glow. It is a journey into a world frozen in time, a landscape scarred by tragedy and haunted by the ghosts of the past. Guided tours take visitors through the abandoned city of Pripyat, its empty streets and decaying buildings serving as a chilling reminder of the human cost of the disaster. They visit the remains of the power plant itself, peering into the very heart of the catastrophe. The appeal of dark tourism is complex and multifaceted. For some, it is a way to pay homage to the victims and learn from the mistakes of the past. For others, it is a thrill-seeking adventure, a chance to experience the adrenaline rush of venturing into a dangerous and forbidden zone. Whatever the motivation, there is no denying the growing popularity of dark tourism at Chernobyl. It has become a significant source of revenue for the region, providing much-needed funds for ongoing cleanup and containment efforts. Despite the ethical concerns, dark tourism at Chernobyl is likely to continue to grow in popularity. I hope you've enjoyed this journey into the strange and fascinating world of Chernobyl. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. And remember, sometimes the truth is stranger than fiction. See you next time, and thanks for watching.